Hello guys, it's Aaron again. Hope you guys are doing good. It's almost end of the year. And well before anything, thank you guys for watching. I am so busy and that's because of you. Thank you guys for supporting me throughout this whole year. And yeah, I am super busy right now. Oh by the way, I knew um working on a new pair of boots. I mean not a new pair of boots, but I'm working on another pair of boots. So a new video is coming up next after after this. Stay tuned please. Uh well I got another pair of boots now these boots were sold to me by one of the uh, subscribers so he sent me pictures of the boots I haven't opened the box yet because I wanted to do it in front of you and uh, but these are the uh, blacksmith 2955 in the black Spitfire leather these are discontinued as well and these are size 10 i haven't tried them on yet i haven't opened up the box yet i haven't done anything i just received the boot i mean the box today the package today they were sent to me about six days ago and i just received them today so these boots have been worn only probably four times the customer told me they're basically new he wore them only four times and the reason is he's selling them is because they're too tight for him he is a size 10 and a half and he got this in size 10 but they're just too tight for uh, for him so that's why he offered them to me and i was like he sent me pictures and i liked them and i was like you know what i want them i want them so let's open up the box guys and see what's inside ¿Qué tal? Bueno, pues ya saben, como siempre tengo que hacerlo, tengo que hacerlo en dos partes para toda la para toda la banda de habla hispana. Acabo de comprar unas botas, ya no iba a comprar botas ahorita, bueno, esta semana. <risa> Pero lo que pasa es que un suscriptor, un suscriptor me ofreció esas botas, vio el video donde me habían transeado y todo y tiene bastantes botas el, el esta persona y me ofreció estas botas porque le quedan a él muy justas, él es size 10 y medio, pero se le ocurrió agarrarlas en size 10 y no, nunca le quedaron, se las ha puesto unas cuatro veces nada más y vio el video donde yo, donde yo hablaba de, pues de que me transearon y de las botas que compré, las, las, este, las Beckman, las pasadas que compré y me contactó y me ofreció esas botas, que se las ha puesto, dice, cuatro veces nada más porque no, no las aguanta, están muy apretadas yo no las he visto, o sea, he visto fotos y todo, obviamente, antes de comprarlas. Me refiero que no he abierto la caja, no, no he visto nada, porque lo quiero hacer aquí con ustedes, como siempre. Cada que compro un par de botas, me gusta compartirlo con ustedes. Y honestamente, a mí no me gusta comprar botas usadas, a menos que sean de... que ya no existen y están en muy buenas condiciones. Nada más, nada más, porque vaya a ser un experimento. Pero estas botas se las ha puesto cuatro veces el cliente nada más. Y bueno, vamos a mirar. Yo no las he visto. A ver qué tal están. Espero que les guste. Estas son unas Blacksmith 2955. Es un cuero especial. Súper, súper engrasado. Y es, es un cuero volteado que se dice Rough Out. Entonces vamos a verlas porque yo no las he visto. ¿Sale? Gracias por ver el video y vámonos duro. There's another box. A box inside of another box. Let's see. Okay. Tan 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 tan. Moment of truth. Let's see. Ooh. They look okay. I can tell he didn't wear this. <laughs> but just for time like he mentioned. Look at this. Now this is a rough out leather rough out leather you see now these boots are discontinued well at least you cannot get them in the states and yeah this is heavily waxed leather you see that this is all wax all wax
Yep. Well, they're nice. I gotta try them on. Yeah. Foot bed is in excellent conditions. Excellent conditions. Wow, wow, wow. Look. So, yeah, size 10. I was buying size 10 and a half, but this is what happened to me. And I'm, I'm pretty sure most of the people make the same mistake. Uh, I was buying my boots in size 10 and a half because I was like, oh, they always have to fit me a little bit loose. But what happens is that when you break the boots in, the leather stretches out a little bit, so now they fit you big. So now that's why I'm buying size 10, not 10 and a half. My bad, except for the uh, 1907s and the 88, 83s, you know, because those have an insert. So those have to be 10 and a half. You have to get a half size. You have to go half size up for sure. But not on this one, no. I'm size 10 on this one. See this? You see these these lines here? That's because of the wax. See, that's because of the wax. Because you can tell they're not worn out. I mean, like he said, he only worn this a few times. Literally, he said four times, but they're just too tight for him. Anyway, well, this is pretty much about it, guys. The blacksmith twenty nine. Am I right? Yeah, twenty nine fifty five. Black Spitfire, rough out leather with bronze hardware. See, four pairs of eyelets and three pairs of speed hooks. Love speed hooks, to be honest. I love speed hooks. Now, uh, I think I'm gonna wear this a few times before I do the wrestle. To be honest, I want to break this in and just look at the look at the well. This is a beautiful well. Look at that. This is a nice well. This is a nice well. Still, I'm gonna replace it. <laughs> oh, look. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let's see, what, what else? Oh, I have the laces. Flat wax laces. I love these laces too. Look at that. Wow, 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 wow. So, now let's see, they fit me. Woo! They fit me perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now I'm gonna replace this, these laces. I'm gonna get leather laces. I'm gonna get this color to match the, uh, the weld. Yep. Well, these are my regular Lucky Brand jeans. A little baggy. <laughs> But anyway, what do you guys think? They fit me perfect, guys. So I am definitely size 10 in the A last. So, which is the uh, Iron Ranger, Beckman's, Blacksmith's. Hmm. Wow. Beautiful. I like them. I like them. Thank you, Julio, for sending me these boots. For selling me these boots, actually. <laughs> and uh he was very nice i'm not gonna tell you how much i paid for this boot but definitely i got a good good deal and the best is that these are almost brand new brand new guys what do you guys think about this yeah i'm gonna replace the laces so let's see how they look let me change them all right guys so here they are i think i like this better the leather laces, I like the contrast between the well, the black leather, and the laces. What do you guys think? So again, these are the 29.55 black sp <laughs> split. I was gonna say split, split fire leather. And that what that means is that they have a, lo a lot of wax lots of wax and this is a rough out leather mm. 
Well, this is a nice well, nice weld. <laughs> Mm -hmm. all right thank you guys for watching let me know what you guys think about this if any of you have these boots let me know I guess that's about it guys thank you for joining me so let's see what Santa Claus brings us this time this year I should say this year this 24 <laughs> thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one pues ahí está le cambié las agujetas, le puse estas agujetas, me gustan más que las negras, no sé qué piensen ustedes, pero pienso que hace un mejor, un mejor contraste, por lo menos para que me volteen a ver y digan, ¿qué es eso? <risa> no, se ven bien, creo que hace, hace, hace buen contraste, como dije, y mencionaba que el huevo de estas botas está en excelentes condiciones, excelentes condiciones, ahora el problema de estas, con estas, no problema, pero como esto tiene bastante wax, se va todas las, las marcas de, del pie, es decir, cuando, cuando camina el doblez que hace aquí y todas las marcas que hay aquí, obviamente se van a ir quebrando y se marcan por tanto wax que tiene, es normal, digamos. Se va, digamos que se van a ir viendo como viejas las botas, así rápido, pero es por el, los quiebres que hace y más que nada la, el wax pues que hace las marcas, porque como pueden ver, apenas, apenas aquí las usaron, por eso apenas tiene este quiebre aquí, nada más, cuando vaya a comprar botas, fíjese en eso. En el footbed, el footbed está excelente. Y pues aquí puede ver. Y la suela, obviamente la suela es la que le va a decir que tan viejas están. Pues ya las ensucié ahorita porque me las puse allá afuera. <risa> las traía caminando allá afuera. Pero bueno, ahí están las botas. Déjenme saber qué les parecen. Agarramos otro parcito antes de que llegue Navidad. A ver qué nos trae Santa Claus todavía. ¿Sale? <risa> Entonces muchas gracias. Nos vemos en el próximo video. Estamos trabajando ahí en otras botitas. Gracias.